a lot of peace in Somalia, especially in the capital Mogadishu, is the result of the efforts of Uganda's armed forces deployed under the African Union mission in Somalia. We need all of you down. Officers of the Uganda police also serve on the peacekeeping mission. Basically, we are here to provide operational support to the Somali police force. We do it in carrying out joint patrols. Then we also do it in giving security or giving protection to vital government installations. You discover that we've contributed a lot in one, even building new police stations for them, even renovating the old ones that are there already that were destroyed or dilapidated during the war. And at the same time, we even help them to generate uh, equipment that is through the reform and restructuring. Last evening, these officers, together with their Nigerian counterparts, were on night patrol duty. Preparation is key ahead of the patrol. Among the men that you have for the night, please give us 44 personnel, the board 890 and 883. Right now we are penetrating more into uh, Mogadishu. We are in uh, Mamba, for those, of you, for those of you that know this uh, armored vehicle. It's uh, pretty strong and uh, we've been told that uh, the door there weighs about uh, 200 kgs. And once they're out on the streets, they have to be extra vigilant. <laughs> According to the Somalia Transition Plan, all foreign security forces are expected to be out of the country by 2021. Ali Mivole, NTV, Somalia.